What's up guys and welcome to another Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire video and today I am bringing you some information regarding the Eon ticket for the games that should be revealed you know recently in the past couple of days by the Pokemon company and the, the official sites and everything and everything and everything and everything like that. Anyway so if you guys don't remember the Eon ticket was in the original Ruby and Sapphire games and Emerald I think um, and basically it allows you to go to Southern Island to catch either Latios or Latias, the one that, um, you know, the other one, the opposite one you don't normally get in the games. So, that's, you know, that's a good thing. Um, we, we actually know how to get it. Now, a lot of people actually, you know, oh, it's going to be a worldwide Wi-Fi event at some point. It's going to be, you know, maybe it's not. No, it's slightly different now. The first, the official Japanese site uh, announced that while you can get the Eon ticket for an event, if you do receive it, you have the capability of sharing it to other people through Street Pass that haven't actually got the event themselves. So similar how you could you could actually share the Eon ticket by mixing records in the original games. You don't lose your Eon ticket, however, it stays on your game forever once you have it, so you can always share it to other people. But that's the first one. So you know, all it said, first sort of thing was announced. Okay, it's for an event, so maybe it was in-store event, something like that. Not quite, not quite, not quite. Then the Pokemon Company announced it for the UK. It announced the Eon ticket relay. And this is slightly different. This is going to begin with Junichi Masuda himself giving the Eon ticket out at the launch event on Saturday, November 29th. So that's a day after the actual release of the game. Uh, from there, 15 winners will be sent to various game stores to spread the Eon ticket through Street Pass. More details about this are going to be released on November, November 13th. But basically, on November 13th, there are going to be details on how to enter this little, I guess, competition or picking, you know, of the thing for the Eon ticket relay. And 15 people don't know. We don't know whether the, the cities are going to be set already, or whether you can just apply and the 15 people get chosen at random. But 15 people from 15 different cities are going to be chosen to attend this event in on Saturday, November 29th, in London, the launch event of Auras. Get the code, get the um, Eon ticket on their 3DS, and meet Junichi Masuda, and meet Junichi Masuda. Uh, and then they will be sent to various game stores throughout the UK. So maybe if I'm, for example, I've, I'm definitely going to be fucking entering because I really want to. You have no idea, guys, how much I would love to go. One, be at the launch event of Mega Ruby Alpha Staff. That'd be amazing. Two, be one of the first people to get the Eon ticket, which should, you know, it's not, not, it'd be cool anyway. You know? um, and then meeting, meeting Masuda, meeting Junichi Masuda, one of the people at the core of Pokemon. For many, years, that would be... It may well be the highlight of my life um, so far, um, but I would love to. I would really would love to go. Oh my god, it'd be so amazing. Anyway, so basically, you go to the London event. The 15 people go. They get a ticket, and then they'll be told to okay, on maybe the next weekend, possibly you know, on uh, December the sixth or fifth or something like that. Come to you know the game store in Bristol. For example, for me, either at the Mall or maybe Cabot Circus or you know whatever store I ch I'm chosen to, or if I you know, whatever store I'm assuming Bristol's gonna be one of the cities. It's just because it's sort of it's moved around, I guess. Um, basically, they would choose a game store in each city, and the person that gets the ticket is told go to the game store. You know, go to this game store then on this day, and then there'll be an event hosted then. It'll say you know come and get your Eon ticket. So then everyone that wants an Eon ticket will turn up their 3DSs, and the person that gets it from London will then street pass it to everyone in the store at the event, uh, which is actually a really that quite like, nice thing. So then everyone at the event gets it. They sort of spread out across. Obviously, these 15 cities are going to be dotted around. So be, London will definitely be one. Maybe two or three stores in London, possibly. Then Bristol, Birmingham, Manchester, Edinburgh, Glasgow, possibly. So all over the country. So then people will come to the store, get the ticket, and then they will spread out back into their own little, little towns or little cities around everywhere. And this will be a relay, you know. And the, the, the ticket will get passed between people. It's really sort of a cool thing. Obviously, it's not great for people that don't want to leave the house. I uh, would rather just get it sort of for a while. But it's actually really cool and really fun there. I'm definitely going to be entering this event once we get more details. I would love to go, oh my, it would, I, I can't express how much I would love to go to London and be part of that event, but I doubt I will unfortunately, but I'm going to try, I'm going to enter, I'm going to try, and oh, I wish I, I, I really do hope I get picked for Bristol, but we'll see. Then it was also announced for the US that serial codes for the Eon ticket will be given to play Pokemon organizers which are basically I think little Pokemon tourneys that are in each city and also heads of street pass groups so on, on November 21st so when the games actually get re released um, everyone, anyone that's a head of a street pass group or head of a, a play Pokemon organizer which I'm guessing are little tournaments things are given serial codes 
they then get the Eon ticket on their games, and then they street pass it to other players at their events, and a similar sort of thing happens in every city, it spreads out like that. These are the only countries that have had actually, um, sort of details for so far, so we don't know anything about, you know, other European cities or other, you know, Australia or anything like that, but that's what we got so far for the UK and the US. I'm really excited for the UK one. Ugh, I really, I really want to go. I really want to be picked. Um, but uh, I don't know. I guess we'll have to see how it goes. But that's the details for the Eon ticket, guys. You guys can let me know down below in the, the comment section what do you think of the fact that it's actually via Street Pass and the events are going to be only sort of. It's not going to be a global event. You know, it's not going to be like you can just go to a store and get it. It's sort of a relay. You have to actually. It's a bit more interactive. It's not like we've had before with a Wi-Fi event. It's just like, yep, there are, there's a ticket or a game event. It's like, come in the game, come in the store, you can get, you know, a code, and then you've got the end ticket. It's actually sort of a bit more than that. It's just a bit more than that. I guess they're looking to obviously with all the little different events they got. Obviously, the relay in the UK and the other stuff in the US. I guess they're sort of just trying to get a bit more involved in some way. I guess and that's what I'm trying to explain there. But I really, I really like the idea, guys. You guys can let me know down below what you think of the Eon ticket relay for the UK and other, you know, whatever they want to call the US one, just the general distribution for the US, and what you think they're going to do for other countries. I assume they're going to be similar things where they give them to leaders of stores and stuff like that, and then you have to go in and street pass it and whatnot at certain events. But let me know what you think down below in the comments section, guys, about this, and uh, you know whether you're gonna, if you're in the UK, or whether you're gonna try and head along to this event. I'm assuming it's over 18 years only, unfortunately. Um, because obviously you have to actually go to London, go to the event, and then actually attend the thing. Obviously, under 18s could be possible, but you have to be able to commit to go to those events, so you have to see. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to smash the like button down below and tell me what you think about the Eon ticket distribution. But for now, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll be seeing you next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye, my friends.